So Chris, we're now a couple of days after the, the Cup game on front of the, the BBC cameras. Deservedly through over the piece. Uh, what were your thoughts in, on the, the 120 minutes as it planned out? Well, it was a difficult game. First half was really tricky. Uh, tight pitch. Surface was a wee bit bobbly. Uh, must have been fair to them were, were excellent. I thought they were high energy. Didn't give us a chance to play. Run our faces. Maybe probably about 30, 35 minutes we started to hold the ball a bit more. We got a wee bit side to side. Uh, and at half time, I think, in the second half, you'd see must have tired a wee bit. We managed to get the ball moving side to side, create a few chances. We a few scares ourselves. You know what I mean? There was one Jack, it's one of the Jack, there's one they can hit the post to get more pressure on the ball there. But I think they deservedly went in the lead. Uh, really good goal for Connor, hit a target, just made sure he hit a target and delighted for him to get his first goal. And then he was a poor goal from their point of view. Jack comes, doesn't get there, he gets ahead of Pete and he flicks into the net. So it was a wee bit of sucker punch, but to be fair to the boys, he showed great character. He said to them, they thought he dominated the extra time. Got the second uh, through Martin, brilliant play inside, good through ball to Keane over to Connor, a great finish for Martin. And the third one, uh, Keane gets goal and thoroughly deserved. I thought it was excellent on the, on the night. And, uh, we were disappointed to lose an our goal, but we'll take a victory and it was good to get the next round. You mentioned the, the, the three goals in the front three, if you want to, to call them that, all being involved, all either scoring or um, assisting the others. That must have been a particularly pleasing aspect for yourself and the oh, background stuff. Definitely, I was delighted. Delighted for Connor because he does a lot of work and he's been, you can see he was a bit frustrated that not getting a goal maybe uh, in a game previously, snatching a few shots. And I'd spoke to him, so I had to relax and, and, and do what you do in training and it was good to see him get a goal. Uh, Ikino was excellent, I thought. Second half especially, really came into his own and thoroughly deserved Martin matching. And Martin Rennie's scoring, I think that's five, six goals he's got now. Uh, so, you know, it's really good to play. But also good, I thought, uh, when he came on, it was excellent. Great, great energy, it's good to have him back. Uh, no, there was lots of pleasing aspects, but things we can work on as well. I think we still give away goals too cheaply. Uh, I think things get get more pressure on the ball at times and, and help the teammates out. Sometimes we get away, but it's things we can work on. You mentioned the, the return of Liam Scullion and, and the impact that it made on the bench. That's obviously a big bonus, but with it being quite a gruelling 120 minutes, did the boys make it through fairly injury free? Perhaps a wee bit leggy with the, the pitch being quite quite soft, but on the whole, on the whole, health. yeah, everybody's came through the, the, the game not a problem. Uh, Mark Rennie's a bit tight, so a wee bit less tonight, just to kind of kind of nurse and manage him. But apart from that, everybody is still uh, fit available. The wins no barricade. And then looking ahead to the the game specifically in Spartans, what type of match are you expecting? They've, they've had a very good start mm -hmm. to their, their first um, League Two campaign. The Spartans we played them in the opening day. Quite frustrating not to see out the, the victory, hoping to put that wrong right this Saturday. Aye, definitely. Uh, no, you know, they've come up from the division below and they start really well. Some really good results as well, looking at them. And uh, it'll be a very difficult game. We've played them before, so the players will know what exactly what they're about. But again, as I said, you just need to focus on what we do. And I think when we get a ball down and pass it, you saw the second half in the last game, that's when we put our best. So we're going to do more of that again.